I'm super late, but I have to record this tutorial today. So let's see how Stable Diffusion 1.5 behaves in comparison with 1.4 and also the new in-painting model. The links to download the models will be in the description. So let's start in 3, 2, 1, boom. Let's go to the Hugging Face website, link in the description. Download the pruned and the in-painting version. First, you have to accept the agreement terms in both of the files, then go to versions and download the corresponding version for each. Now grab the downloaded files, go to where you installed Stable Diffusion, then go to Models, Stable Diffusion and drop your files there. Then I changed the settings to this, so all the images will have the same parameters. Now let's analyze it all. Pause the video if you want to check the details, also the links to the images will be in the description with their respective prompts. The first candidate is an automaton made by Da Vinci. Looks to me that 1.5 understood better the prompt and have better defined shapes. The winner is 1.5, an anthropomorphic fox detective. Looks like that 1.5 is better defined, but I'm not sure. The winner is, I don't know, a magical land by Ghibli. Looks like that 1.5 retained more of the original prompt and I can see more of the Ghibli reference here. The winner is 1.5, a redhead girl by Makoto Shinkai. Clearly the 1.5 image is way way better, imagine what we'll do with the wife of the fusion. <laughs> the winner is obviously 1.5. Now a great actor that deserves better than this prompt. Clearly on 1.5 the image looks like hair so far. Well the winner is 1.5. I tried to recreate a castle here, I used orthographic on the prompt to see how it would work. The 1.4 looks very nice and it felt the orthographic part in one of the images. The 1.5 looks a bit clearer to me, I don't know. And the winner is 1.5. This was supposed to be a cool image of a city using photojournalism as a reference. The 1.4 looks less crowded and more direct to what I wanted. Maybe if the prompt was better or if I had a better CFG scale, 1.5 would work better. But the winner is 1.4. Boom! A celebrity, Mr. Johnny Depp. Looks like that 1.4 version is a bit better defined and for some reason he loves blue glasses. The winner is... I don't know, I'm not convinced. Now the last one. The most important one. The one you expected all this time. Perfect hands, why not? Well, as you can see, perfect human hands in all of them. Can't say which one is better. The winner is me, that could see such wonder. Now let's test ink painting. I would choose ink painting at full resolution, put 40 steps and change the denoise strength to 1, so the image where I paint will be completely different. I'll use Mr. Depp's picture and paint his face. I'll put a random seat. Now I'll try to change it to something like... Please don't sue me. Amber Heard. And uh, perfection. Wow, wow that, that's unbelievable. <laughs> well, let's change it to the ink painting model and try to generate it again. Now she knows what it is to be in the shoes of the man that find his bed pooped. I say the ink painting model works pretty well. Well, I'm super late. I have to go. I'm sorry. Please like, comment and subscribe to the channel if you like this stuff. I see you after I finish the next tutorial. Adios.